Today we will talk about how to back up your files while Windows installation as you have formatted your C drive and hence the previous version of a window. You must have experienced a condition in which if you are installing a Windows on your PC then you might have formatted your C drive while Windows installation and further as you have formatted your C drive then previous window will not be present on your PC. So here is a solution which is very raw method as I have found this solution while experiencing the same problem on my PC. So spawn on your laptop first and insert the windows installation disk. So here is the windows installation disk. And just restart your PC. And as you are restarting, your PC will take automatically booting devices. Sorry for the delay. One second. So here is your booting device. As you can see, Windows is loading files for the Windows 7 installation. Just wait for the loading. Now, here comes the language selection section. Just select your language and keyboard format and here you can select all the language languages and click next. Now, here, click on the install now. Here comes the option of which version of Windows 7 you want to install. Uh, I'm installing Windows 7 Ultimate 64 bit. So by selecting, click the next button. Accept the license set terms. And click on this custom advice. That option is for the purpose. Click on the custom advice as you will be going to format your C drive. Click on it. Here comes an issue. Now as you can see here, here it is written Windows cannot be installed to the disk 0 partition 1. Disk 0 is that in my case disk 0 contain all my drives that is uh, C drive and uh, all other drives. D, e. So I just want to click on the show detail first. First of all you select your drive on which you want to install show details. As you can see it's showing windows cannot be installed to the disk. A selected disk is of GPT partition style. So here I want to tell you there are two types of partition styles. One is GPT and other one is MBR. And Windows installation just take on a GPT partition style only cannot uh, sorry uh, on MBR partition style but not on GPT partition style so first of all I would like to recommend here that you just do not format your 
C drive because if you format your C drive then you won't be able to open your previous windows and you can't change the partition style as you will be installing the windows on MBR partition style and if you are formatted by mistake then just remove this installation uh, process don't install the windows and here I want to tell you something that if you click on the repair your computer then the method I just want to show you will not work here as the version of system recovery option is not compatible as uh, my PC earlier Windows 8 was installed so as it is a latest version in comparison to Windows 7 so it will not work so close the installation and shut down your PC and make out the arrangement for Windows 10 in your disk or pen drive I have my bootable pen drive here and Windows 7 is present in this drive so I just first of all open the disk the disk my Windows 7 installation just remove the disk first and just put the Windows installation booting device in your PC I'm putting Windows 10 through my bootable pen drive Start your PC. Now your PC will take Windows 10 installation with the booting device you have inserted. Windows 10 installation starts. I'm not going to install Windows 10 on my PC. I'll install 7 only but I'm showing you how to back up your files. As you have uh, formatted your C drive and you want to back up your other files which are present in other drives that is DEC. Now, use, what you have to do is just select this language first same as we have done in Windows 7 and don't click on the ins uh, install now button just click on the repair your computer and here I want to tell you that this version of Windows is the latest in comparison to Windows 8 and this repair tool will work definitely work for your PC and as you can see this is working just click on the troubleshoot and there will be three options you click on the second one Microsoft Diagnostic and Recovery Tool Set and as you can see there are many options here and if you want to back up your files then you just open this file explorer of your PC here you can find this file explorer here you can find this file explorer here as you can see this the file explorer it will open your file explorer and here you can find all the drives that you have in your PC in my case these drives are there I have named according to my and this is Windows uh, C drive, E drive, X. From here you can uh, back up your files to any pen drive or uh, hard disk. You can back up your files. And after backing up your files, just copy and paste in your uh, hard disk and close this installation also. Just click on the turn off PC. So in this way, you can back up your files first before the Windows 7 installation as we are going to clean up the Windows uh, clean up the, those all drives because of the Windows
Windows 7 installation as we are going to change the partition style on the boot time. So here I'm going to show you how to change the partition style on the boot time. And in this case, uh, you will be doing is that uh, you will be cleaning all the files from your PC. No files will be present in any of the drive. And here is the way I will show you. Just on your PC. And again, you insert the Windows 7 installation disk. Here is my Windows installation disk. Windows 7 is installing again. Now here is the method I'll show you that how to install Windows 7. As you have backup your files, now you can delete your files. Have this Windows installation again. You select the languages and click on the next button and click on the install now button in this case. Now select the option the Windows, the version of the Windows you want to install. I want to install Windows. 64 bit click on the agreement system advance now here you have to do a little small thing just run your command room just press shift uh, sorry function shift f10 just press function shift f10 in your laptop or pc directly you can press Shift F10 and you can run this command prompt and type disk part in this. And in this part, just you press list and click enter. And after this, just select the, the disk in which all your drives are there. In my case, it's a disk 0. I have all my drives in disk 0. So I'm going to select disk 0. So press uh, select disk 0. Now here you can see that disk 0 is now selected is written on the screen. And you just type clean here. Now clean will clean all and delete all the and format all your drives of your PC so here just enter the disk part as you can see the disk part is succeeded in cleaning the disk and here is the method that you can convert to NPR form from GPT just type convert and as you can see disk part successfully converted the disk to MPR format 
Now you just exit the command prompt. Close this tab. Now close this tab also. And go to again Windows installation. Click on the install now button. Now again you select the option for the version of Windows. I want to install, I want to install Windows 7. Now as you can see all your data has been deleted and here you can do some partition according to your disk and Windows 7 will now be installed on your PC as you can see there is no option written on this just click on this and drive option advance you can have partition just click on this new button you can create partition according to your size So first drive that you will be selecting is the C drive. So according to your partition you select how much space you want to uh, locate in the C drive. I want something around uh, 250 GB. GBs of data and now again partition of this I want to have four partitions one for C drive another three for my extra purposes so 35 As you can see, I have my four partitions. I want to install Windows on this partition. The partition is in my C drive. So I want to install. Click the next button now. And now, as you can see, the Windows is installing the files on your PC. And this way, your Windows installation finally starts after your data has been backed up. All the errors has been fixed. So in this way you, you can do the thing. So if you like my video, just make sure you subscribe my channel and comment the question below.